Boys and girls, we're here at the Darren Langford Fishing Compound. And he's about to share some details with us on what he's catching all these big old bass, what he's hoping to be able to bring home 50 plus thousand dollars here in the next week on. He's digging through the arsenal back here. Uh, but if you're watching this, this is going to be exclusively on TrumanLakeFishingIntel.com. So head over there to the website. He's going to be breaking down some of his favorite baits, talking about some of the latest patterns leading up to this next weekend, which is September 17th, 18th, 19th time frame. Uh, tons of bass tournaments going on this coming weekend, and this is going to be great stuff for those bass fishermen out there to be watching this from one of the longtime Truman Lake, extremely high performers, won a lot of tournaments, Darren Langford. So stay tuned for that, and we're going to get into the video. Hey, this is Darren Langford, and I've got some baits here and some rods here. I was going to share a few tricks that I do and, and the way I do setups for late summer, early fall fishing. And some of this stuff works great right at this time, and then it kind of changes here and there as the temperatures cool off. You start getting some cooler nights. But right now, Truman is kind of on fire, has been for a month. Or two it's been really good uh, there's a lot of people fishing there's a lot of pressure out there right now um, we got the Toyota series getting ready to start uh, this next week there's a couple charity tournaments also this next week so the lake's gonna get busy busy this weekend uh, I believe the Toyota series starts actually on Thursday's first day of competition so there's going to be 140 ish boats in that, 75 boats in another tournament, and another tournament at Long Show is going to have 25 to 30. So it's going to be a busy lake. But there's still plenty of fish. You just got to get jump in there and fish. Don't, don't look up, just fish. One of my go to baits. 